around them three houses. Houses. <sighs> Ethan's got to stop taking so long. Hey, buddy! <laughs> <laughs> buddy, buddy, hey, I got some like on in this bad boy. Uh, uh, well, first of all, what took you so long? I've been waiting all day, man. Well, I'm sorry, man. I just had to get this, get this bad boy over here. <sighs> let it slide this time. Uh, what? Well, let me take, uh, give, give me three guesses. Uh, ooh, uh, Blue Scoops package? No, this is not like an actual game. It's a show. Uh, uh, the latest copy of EA's next upcoming sports game. No, why would I buy that trash full copies game? Uh, well, look, what uh, look was talking. We bought, bought, uh, you, we, you bought Anthem. Well, that's just because it was Bioware, of course. Okay. Uh, hmm. Uh, I get, I uh, give. Oh, what do you? What is it? It should be inside. It should be. I I saw you have this game, but <gasps> it, it is gonna be this game. But however, it's more better than that. Ooh. Well, uh, I guess it's finally time to get to recording that unboxing video, huh? The fans have been waiting all day. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Of course they are. All right, let's get to our recording. Uh, uh, let's get recording, then. All right, see you on the other side. Hi, guys. It's Music Clues here. Sai is super late today. Ethan had a lot of stuff to do, so... The recording video video is a little late tonight, <laughs> but uh, hey, we did a switch launch at uh, 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 at midnight, so. Oh yeah, I mean yes, and of course, subscribers. Obviously, I'm Ethan, and if you all don't remember me, just in case. <laughs> yes. Uh, so uh, obviously it has been a long time coming. So here's why we're gonna do this. We're obviously gonna unbox what's in. This bad boy, it's Ethan's special Seasons of Warfare edition of Fire Emblem Three Houses, which just came out today for Nintendo Switch. Yup. Then after that, we're going to go over a real quick review of what um, uh, what games Nintendo's had so far on Switch in terms of first party. Uh, and then after that, we're going to real quick go over third party as well. And then, uh, and then after that, we're going to close out with me starting up three houses for the very first time. Yeah, obviously my Nintendo Switch is back at my house, so I'll just play when I get back. Yeah, uh, but without further ado, guys, are you ready? Ready to be revealed of my brand new bad boy inside? <laughs> All right, get ready for the SpongeBob reference. The secret formula is coming! <laughs> okay, so uh, it's been a very, very, very busy, uh, busy two weeks. Uh, good news for those who didn't hear on the Discord, Laura will be returning tomorrow, so uh, things will be going back to normal very soon here. Uh, just a small heads up. All right. Oh, looks like Ethan's opening it right now. <clears throat> Obviously, I have this. Just a reminder of the receipt. That's obvious. Uh, as you know, I already ordered this for online because due to the fact that I'm the game stop when you go over to the retainers, the pre-orders will be like, down the drain. Yeah, unfortunately, when Ethan went to pre-order it, uh, literally two hours after the announcement of Final Fantasy Houses, it pretty much went out the window, window very quick. Guys. I, I I just I just blow up my reaction. I was like, I'm gonna just be oh guys, you don't know something. I got the three pins! I got these three good pins, man! This is so awesome! Oh yeah, these pins are just oh man, oh man. I really love Nintendo. I really love Nintendo! <laughs> well, I would say this is actually just like reminds me of Go open up the little 
Follow them three hours to follow them echoes. Pins like this. But instead, they're all just... They're just the retro characters from, like, in, uh, <laughs> just, like, from, well, how do I see it? Okay. From Echoes. Alright, so, a close-up of the pins, for those who can't see. Hey, buddy, may I have the Black Eagles pin? That's fine. Thanks. Oh, uh, there's more. This is your new friend, my new friend. He's gonna be all revealed in this box. Starlight got his copy. He's one of our fans of Twitter. Uh, he got his copy earlier. So, by the way, wait, uh, how'd you get your box? I assume via UPS? Yes. <sighs> uh, yeah, his package was late in the day, too. Seriously, UP. Seriously, seriously, GameStop, you need to get be better service. Well, they, 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 I think what it is is. There, there. They, I remember they did just send it out like last night, and then just got here and where close to we live. I'm at another city, not where we live, of course. Yeah, definitely. Oops. <laughs> well, that's okay, cause that's okay. Yeah, it's a little rip, but that ah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Anyway, it's out of the way. All right, let's see if I do get the steelbook or not. We shall see. Okay, this might remind me from the five, five uh, echoes. And what's this? Down, down, down. Get out! Get out, Tendo. <laughs> Take a look, guys. <laughs> First. First. <laughs> Here is the sound selection CD. Comes with all Nintendo games, obviously. Mm -hmm. Then we got a 2020 album calendar. Eve is gonna be using this next year. <laughs> That's great. Oh, <laughs> uh, and just for a preview, this is what it looks like on the inside. There's some art on top, and obviously calendar on the bottom. Pretty all right, awesome, guys. What's even better? Is an art to the problem. Three houses. It's like an art book. 20, 22 to 220 pages. Well, one. at least I got an art book. And the last thing was the best is this. The steel book. book. That's what I was expecting, Tendo. That's what I was expecting. Well, let's see what's the, the game is inside first. All right. Could you do the problem sound effect for me? Ta-da! Wow, that looks much better than the... The one that the musicals has. Just for comparison, this is what the regular case looks like. Yup. So he even got a pretty good steelbook. Uh, note that this is Ethan's second steelbook that he ever got. Well, as you saw on YouTube, I don't know you guys saw, like... Me unboxing uh, the Exumbly Chronicles 2 Special Edition. That was like this. But then instead, it looks like that. Exactly. So this is the inside of the case. My case looks exactly the same. So, but And finally, last but not least. What the game looks like. Here's the look of the cartridge. It's going to be hard to say, but hey, what can you do about it? You guys will probably see a close-up of, of it if you have your own copy of the game. But, yeah. So that's a pretty awesome special edition. Way to go, Nintendo! You knocked that out of the park again! Yeah, I know. I think they, they, the calendar right there was a blow on the park as well. No kidding. Ethan probably can't wait to listen to the soundtrack later. He'll probably use that in his truck. Yep. <laughs> of course. Alright, and... Obviously... I'll use. I'll get. I'm gonna put this pin on my uh, on my Sonic hat, uh, so that way everybody knows what my first house for Final Fantasy houses was. Right. Of course. All right. So, did you want to open the steel? Uh, open the app up real quick to show them what it looks yeah, like. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Um, you can go ahead and open this up. I'll just get these bad boys first. Oh my gosh, this looks amazing. Okay, guys, I'm not going to show you too much so I don't spoil it for those who do have the special edition I'm still waiting for it, but... O-M-G. Yep. Okay, just for example, this 
is concept art for the male character in Fire Emblem, Fire Emblem Free Houses. There it is. It's yours. Ah, thanks. Okay, here's a quick close look, close look, close look at that black eagle pin. And I will definitely put this on my hat later. And here is a look at the female. That's pretty awesome. Even we'll probably have to take a look at this later. Yup, when I have the chance, of course. Alright, so last but not least, it's time to go over all the games that we've ha had released so far for the Switch. We're gonna do, I think we're gonna do this every two years to recap and see how Nintendo's been doing. Yeah, so what you could do, do that, I'll just take the, and all of this to this. Alright. While you do that. Alright, sounds good. Here you go, buddy. Alright. You know what? I'll leave. I'll leave this out for just to listen to the soundtracks. I had a had a feeling you would do that on your way back home. Okay. So, st so for, first things first. First, the Switch launched two years ago, guys. Two years ago. I can't believe it's already two years. Years and we got already so many games. But two years ago. And it's been four years in the making making that we were waiting for this game. We have Legend of Zelda. Oh wait, hold on. Legend of Zelda, Breath of the Wild came out. It was our launch title, big launch title for the Nintendo Switch. That, All right. I'm gonna open this up real quick while you're at it. Alright. Then, next up, we have... Oh. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. A port of uh, uh, the Kart Racer for Nintendo Switch. Um, then... Ooh, it's brand new with all the, all the memes of the soundtracks. Okay, well, I'll have to listen to some of them, but... I don't know if I'm gonna be able to recognize them from the start, but if you want to play this game, I should. Oh yeah, definitely. I have a feeling Ethan's gonna be listening to the uh, listening to a lot of Fire Emblem music this weekend. <laughs> uh, then we have <laughs> Super Mario Odyssey. Yes, ah man. Oh, and let's not forget, we also have. Arms. Well, obviously, guys, if you're wondering if I still own that game, unfortunately, I traded it away. And just recently ending this web fest is <laughs> Splatoon 2. The sequel from the first one from the Wii U. Oh, yeah. Then we entered our second year, and it brought even. Oh, I knew we forgot one more. One of Ethan's favorites. I'll let him introduce this one. Out of Dizzy 2, well, actually, from the third party from uh, Ubisoft, but it still counts as a Tinder exclusive. So, I introduce you to my good old friend, a strategy game, Ma yeah. Mario and Rabbit Kingdom Battle. And yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yep. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so you two <laughs> bought even more games. So obviously you already seen Kirby Star Allies. That was the first game that came out for Switch. Which, uh, but then the second game that came out for Switch that everybody looked forward to was this one. Hi, Will. Oh wait, hold on a second. Gotta do it with the sound effect. Da 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 da. Hi, Warriors. Definitive Edition. Yup. With all the DLC from the Wii U and 3DS version, plus Breath of the Wild costumes. Obviously. Then, we got... <laughs> Mario Tennis Aces. Of course. Uh, definitely a good tennis game if you're looking for something to play. Yup. Then, we've got two of three Pokemon games. Technically, there's one more, but that's free to play, so I don't count it. Uh, but this was our first ever Pokemon game on Nintendo Switch. Uh, oh, hold on. Pikachu! 
Pokémon Tournament DX. Obviously, it's a deluxe version, just like Mario Kart 8, but this also came from the Wii U. And it includes two more DLC packs featuring two new characters, characters to play as, as well as a whole bunch of new characters added in, including my and Ethan's favorite from the Aloha, Decidueye. Yeah, so bad in Super Smash Bros. He wasn't in, so that kind of makes sense. It's just a fair share. Shit. Ooh. Still no Sakurai. You could have traded him out. <laughs> just saying. Then we got. <sighs> if it weren't for you, be if I wasn't such a longtime fan of Pokemon and Pikachu Nintendo, I swear you wouldn't have gotten me. But they sucked me into getting. Pokemon, let's go, Pikachu. More like, let's go get it. Ugh. Dang it, Nintendo. <laughs> More like, let's go make MC get the game. Yep. No kidding. That's pretty accurate, bud. And then finally, last year ended up off, off with... Super, sm uh, <clears throat> Super Smash Brothers Ultimate, featuring every single character, plus all fan favorite requests so far. Daisy then, Crumbs then, uh, who else? Okay, so, Prana Plant. Uh, uh. Joker from Persona 5. Oh, yeah, he's the latest DLC, but then there's two more DLC characters coming next, like a hero from Dragon Quest, and lastly, Banjo Kazooie. From, well, there's Banjo Kazooie series. Well, to be honest with you guys, again, I said this many times at this point, this is no surprise. Yeah. I wonder who the last two characters are. And according to what we've been seeing, uh, Nintendo just added the Dragon Quest Spirits today. So that means we'll probably see them soon. Yep. All right. And we started off this year so far with... Bow! Yoshi's! Crafted World. Yep, for sure. Definitely beat this game day uh, in about three days. Fun game. Then I ended up getting, well, do, 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 Super Mario Maker 2. Well, that's a sequel from the first one. And I still can't believe Nintendo is, is throwing us off. Nintendo, me and if we weren't such big fans of you, fans of you, we'd be very ticked off now. But we're gonna give you a slide this time. We'll see. We'll see next time. <laughs> and then finally, just today, da da da, found them three houses. Obviously, a lot of people think that they look at this game, they think it's almost look like Harry Potter. Well, yes, the themes and everything it is, but in general, it's not a Harry Potter game. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now it's time to go over. Third party games, games, and I have a couple here. So first things first, launch year we didn't have too much much coming on, but we did get a couple games. Uh, of course, one came later, but I'm not gonna complain about that right now. So first year, we started. Uh, I started off the year, year my first purchase ever for a third party outside of digital. I'll let you do this one since it's your favorite, one of your favorite characters. All right, here we go. There's a game. It's going to introduce you first. Will be... Ardogan! Street Fighter 30th Anniversary Collection. Featuring Street Fighter 1, 2, 3, and the Alpha series. All right. And then next we have... Sonic Mania Plus. Which launched the uh, which launched on Nintendo Switch, which physical much later, but it came out digitally that year, so that's why I count. Then we have Sonic Forces. Sonic Forces. And then finally we have down 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 
do 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 Mega Man Eleven. That's the latest latest Mega Man game in installment. Oh yeah, man. Okay, so the second thing I mostly skimped out on digital title titles really, but I did get one. Uh, Ethan did get one game that he's letting me borrow for the time being. I'll let you introduce this one. I'll introduce you to Blaze Blue Cross Tag. You're in battle. Oh yeah! <laughs> I was just making funny, funny phrases for you all. <laughs> <laughs> this one was one of Ethan's favorite games to play, and I can't wait to see see what the team comes. Uh, with Blaze Blue comes out with next. For those who don't know, Guilty Gear 1 and Guilty Gear 3 are available to purchase on Nintendo Switch, so if you've been looking for those games, look no longer. Right. And finally this year, I've actually gotten a lot more games on Nintendo Switch dig uh, physically for third party, and here's what I've gotten so far. So, starting, starting with earlier this year, my first ever third party purchase would be this game Final Fantasy 10 and part 2 oh yeah well obviously I didn't play the game yet but I seen gameplay of it oh yeah then following that that we got two Atlio games back to back first one is a, sp a brand new spin-off series uh Nikola Niki and the legendary alchemist Alkali uh, Atlias of the new world and a brand new standard Atlio game, Atlio Lana, the Scarlet of Alwyn. Right. Then we have <clears throat> Fatality. <laughs> Mortal Kombat 11. Yup, the latest Mortal Kombat game. Of course, that's like the, the for a long time Nintendo has gotten that game from Wonder Brothers. Oh yeah, and now we have Team, Team Sonic Racing. Yep. I also got it on Xbox Digital, and finally, recently, and you've seen the gameplay of this on the channel. We also have Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's Marvel Ultimate Alliance. Free the Black Order. Yep. And that <laughs> has been all the games that we have purchased so far and have been released so far on Switch. We have gotten a big variety. Yes. Well, yeah, so like I said, I'm out the foul game, guys. The latest game we're getting here. And of course, there's a few questions to ask. There's a few questions to ask. My opinion, of course. Yeah. And not MC, of course. Yeah. Uh, there's two questions in particular. One, will the story top awakenings? Now, because there's three houses, that means three different stories, just like Fates. Yeah, Fates only had two or like separate, separate, uh, like sides. And three is just all together. But this one's a bit different. Yeah. So, there's three houses, but they'll probably all have different perspectives of the battle. Battle, no doubt. So, we're going to have to play through all three to get the whole picture of the story story first. But, we obviously will play our respective houses that we chose. Uh, uh, so, question one. Will it top awakening? That's story. It's story we're talking Yes. Now, just so you know, if you want to know Ethan's current standings for the previous Diamond games... Well, we can't really count Warriors, so that's a spinoff. No. Uh, Echo Our awesome Token Rod section. Yeah. Echoes? Well... I, I mean, since in second installment, it's a remake from the second installment in the classics. Yeah. And I don't think he needs to repeat himself about Fates. Nah. <laughs> uh, you put that pl plenty of times on his Twitter timeline and probably his channel too, so yeah. Uh, but, yeah. So, story is one. Second question. How will the gameplay feel? Now, the gameplay doesn't look too different from what we're used to with Fire Emblem, but this is the first console game we've had in a while with actual 3D models. As the last one we ever had was way, way back when I... Ike had his last game on Wii. We're talking about Radiant Dawn. I actually even played it. Exactly. Ever since the Feed Yes installment, due to hardware limitations, it's always been spiked right since then. Yeah, so I played Turtles 3D Foam games 
I was like, I do like those types of games. Exactly. So, how different would the gameplay feel? There's only one catch. There's no weapon triangle, which is probably going to throw Ethan off his guard for a while. Uh, well, here I go. It's just like, just like you're in a new world that you've never been to. It feels like that to me. Exactly feels like that. Yep. So, just so you know, guys, if, to me, if actually Top's weakening for once, I'll be surprised. Yeah, me too. Too. And Ethan sets high standards for Awakening since that's his favorite, favorite game of all time for the final series at the moment. So if we, he sounds like a broken record to some of you who hate it, but it's his opinion. Oh, guys, guys, guys. You growing up with their following games, and I ain't growing up this time. It wasn't my first following game, so just let so you know. Yeah, uh, so it's only fair. But uh, regardless, Ethan sets this one on a very high pedestal, still, so... Yeah, this better be good, good, good intelligence systems. Again, again, okay, so if I see some kind of like, some face sides like this again, it might go a little downhill again. But, you never know. Yeah, no kidding, kidding. Now, I'll have you know that me and Ethan have been dodging spoilers like the plague. <laughs> yep. Uh, so, we've had little temptation to look into what face is. That's probably uh, uh, what this game is. That's probably the best we've done. Right. All right. Well, last but not least, time to start this game up for the very first time. Count down with me. Five, four, three, two, one, and... It's going in. Damn. But for me, I'll play this when I get home. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Okay, guys, there it is. Five of them, three houses. All right. Well, oh, that's all for now, guys. Thank you for tuning in to this very lengthy video. Again, sorry for the long wait today, but you gotta, you can't blame Ethan. His package was late, and then on top of that, he had stuff to do, so it was a very late video. Yep. Uh, but I prom promise on next unboxing, which probably will be for a long while, while my new, my new will be great. Like I said, every two years, we'll be recapping the Switch library. And this... Oh, um, I think I think we got thrown off. I am sorry about that, folks. Uh, hey, hey, hey. It just reminds me of, like, a character, like in the, the cartoons. They slip the banana! Whee! Think of that one, guys. Oh, yeah. Okay, let me try this again. You might want to stack them carefully this time. And mind you guys, ooh, this careful man. This whole stack right here is just the first year for first and third party, and that's not even counting digital titles I have currently on Switch. Yep. On top of that, supply for Doom fans, sorta. Uh, uh, Bethesda just dropped Doom 1, 2, and 3, the classics, on the eShop for you guys to buy. Yeah, they're all trilogies. Classic trilogies. Where's a catch, though? You gotta log into the Bethesda account to play. Come on, Bethesda! I know you've... Uh, I know you've... I've heard you've been cheap, but that's a little low for even you. Oh, that hurt. That hurt. I'm sorry, I can't... Yeah, sorry, guys. I'm passing on these. These. And the worst part, part of it is I can't buy the classic versions either because unfortunately they pulled them from the store. So... Ooh. Yeah, that kind of hurts, man. Uh, oh, well. Well, you know, if I really want to play it, I guess I'll have to buy it eventually, but Ethan's probably more into the yeah, classic Dooms than I would. Well, I can try them first. Choo, 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 choo. Uh, but yeah. Oh, in addition to that... Uh, I also got the season pass. Ethan has to get his. It's twenty four dollars, by the way, guys. Uh, you get a special character uh, of the main character in Fire Emblem Heroes, uh, uh, and you get some extra story stuff that's coming later. Yep, yep. Uh, so yeah, but yeah, like I said, it's time for us to go. It's getting very late, and Ethan has got to get back home. Yep, gotta go head back home. All right, so. Signing off for now, this is yours truly, D.
DJ Music Clues. Either in, signing out. And you all have a nice... Do you know?